the ceos are master mariners uh, uh, or or you know marine engineers in a couple of cases but there are a lot of master mariners who are uh, ceos in these companies hi everyone jai hind jai bharat jai mata di welcome to my youtube channel merchant is recorded i have got captain rana with me jinka abhi tak aap most probably bahut sare videos dekh chuke honge guiding youngsters today merchant navy senior officers engineers guiding them how to safely and successfully transition from ship to shore so today's video is about for all those chief officers and captains those who are feeling like quitting sailing but they don't want to go do a shore job which is strictly core shipping shipping sir related in a broader maritime spectrum but not core shipping so captain rana please guide us today with your knowledge bataiye sir kya kara ja sakta hai sir yaar pranit thanks for having me here and uh... I'm being a very upfront. This is my category, right? When I was on ship, uh, I used to see uh, superintendents, and for whatever reason, right? Uh, and then this is absolutely with all due respect to all the superintendents over there. I didn't want to become a superintendent, right? Uh, and um, so I, I looked for various opportunities. For me, luckily, I got into consultancy into port. That was my first shore uh, job. But but you know, this is something which. Um, May very few people knew at my time. You know, this was thirteen years back when I got into port consulting. But but and and for now also maybe not many people know that what else could a uh, you know senior person, a senior officer, deck officer do other than core ship management. So here here are a few um, you know uh, designations, a few uh, industries, a few roles where where you could get into. Number one. um and which is where and only a master mariner can go is pilot right um in india there are so many ports which are coming uh, the ports um, um uh, capacity is increasing more boats are coming which means uh, requirement for pilot is uh, is increases private players are also there So, um, so so there is a lot of lot of demand uh, and lot of employment opportunities and right now honestly the salaries are also very good right so so there are no two ways that you know earlier there was a little less salary for pilots but now the salary is also good very satisfying job you can become a pilot uh second is you can get into the administration so dg shipping mmd you become a surveyor uh, you know you can get into um uh, uh, you can you, you you know essentially you can become a nautical advisor to the government of india in um, if, if you take that uh, route right third is you can go into the maritime boards um not all states have maritime boards but at least most of the coastal states have a maritime board so you are from gujarat you are from chennai you are from vizag you know you don't want to get into core shipping plus you know if you want to get get into core shipping then you don't want to i mean uh, go to uh, bombay delhi and uh, chennai so uh, you know stay there there will be a maritime board you can actually go and join in, in the administrative uh, levels over there um you are more into an ops guy right you you like the hulchal the chahal pehal you know the the uh, ensuring the cargo ops are uh, there you can easily get into cargo operations cargo operations in containers in bulk and oil you know uh, there are enough opportunities you you could get over there um um you could also be into say a warehouse operations or icd cfs operations right um uh, and this is you know a uh, demand for container guys if if you have container background you can actually easily you know there are opportunities and and uh, I'm, i'm happy to say that many companies right now uh, who are into freight forwarding who are into um, container ops uh, port ops the ceos are master mariners uh, uh, or or you know marine engineers in a couple of cases but there are a lot of master mariners who are uh, ceos in these companies right um, you can actually get into agency now w- what is an agency agency essentially liaises the um, the turn around of a vessel so vessel comes in and goes out there are agents who come in so who better to you know manage an agency than a master because he's been doing that 
for so much time on a vessel he knows the in the ins and out so very easily for him to get into a uh, agency um you could again get into vts right um in vts you will probably not be an operator an operator is is probably a little junior but then you, you know you would be someone who will be managing it heading it so not very uh, i mean uh, opportunities available um um in in vts one more thing is that um, many of us know that vts typically is there into uh, congested waters singapore we know gibraltar we know but in india also there are enough uh, vts and more vts is are also coming because the traffic is increasing and the rules and regulations are also increasing so you you see in gujarat you know there is a very good fledging vts and um, so many master mariners working within the vts uh, space in gujarat uh, as such um you can again um, get into shipyards uh, shipyards you will you know uh, manage projects over there manage uh, you know building up a vessel or vessel repairs um so you could become a project manager you can be in the maritime law space as well you you will need to upskill yourself you you don't i mean uh, need to necessarily do a, a law degree but a maritime law degree is something which which can help you to get into uh um, various facets of, uh, of of shipping um and then last but not the least uh, there is uh, surveying right so you can get into the classification society you can get into um um uh, various other kinds of surveys where which, which where you could do fairly well for yourself so yeah those are the fields where you don't want to become a marine superintendent uh, you don't want to become get into crewing there are many opportunities for you to get into. thank you sir thank you very much for so many options that you have given us and uh, one video that i'll be requesting you another yes after two more two or three or more videos that is what all opportunities does a seafarer have maybe an engineer or officer in india so we have been I talking i so we'll be making another video on that kyunki jo karte hue mujhe samajh mein aaya agar ek chief officer captain hai aur wo soche yaar main to india mein rehna chahta hu main nahi karna chahta shipyard mein kaam जबकि मुझे कोरिया में जाना पड़े वॉट ऑल ऑप्शन डू आया सो वी विल मे बी मेकिंग वीडियो ऑन दैट एज वेल सो गाइज प्लीज टे कनेक्टेड वी आर हेल्प टू गाइड यू लेट एस सी हम आपकी कितनी हेल्प कर सकते हैं जय हिंद जय भारत जय माता Hi, Jai Hind, Jai Bharat, Jai Mataji. I hope you like the video. And now, right now, as a deck officer, maybe you're thinking of transitioning from ship to show. There is no harm, provided you make a well-informed, right decision. So, as a seafarer merchant, we decoded website has provided a free course for you guys. The course you can see out here, and in this course, you can find all the options as a third officer, second officer, chief officer, or captain. You have got in core shipping, outside core shipping, outside shipping. what can be the job profile what kind of skill set is required uh, what can, is the salary that you can expect everything is there in this course so please go ahead enroll in this course of course link is in the description box as well as in the comment section jai hind jai bharat jai mata